Hi guys, Ryan here. So today I'm gonna to be going over my trip. All right, so started on Monday and I went through Saturday of last week. All right, so Monday, we drove to Vegas, stayed at the Excalibur Hotel, which was pretty cool because there was like knights in armor around and kind of had that vibe. Then next we had dinner at the Sushi Neko. After that, we visited Manga Hole and Anime Tsubasa. Tuesday, drove to California, stayed at Extended Stay America, Glendale, California, near Universal Studios. For lunch, we ate at Baker, California. For dinner, we had Hummus Republic and also had dinner back at the hotel. Wednesday, Universal Studios. What an awesome day. All right, so we're on our way to Universal Studios yep. and Nintendo Land. Ba -da -da, let's go! Let's go! And let's go! Are you excited for that? Yeah, I am. Yeah. We're here at Nintendo World. Ooh, Universal. Excited? Yeah, I am. What's your best toad impression? I'm toad! <laughs> Say that toad, welcome to Nintendo World. Welcome to Nintendo World! <laughs> <laughs> Going up here.
All right, we're headed to the Harry Potter area and I want to get some butter beer. So that should be good. in history to one of the largest sets in film history. We have now entered Steven Spielberg's War of the Worlds. The airplane crash site set is a perfect example of a set that is all designed around a vision of Steven. He said, yeah, to sit down and talk about the world. Well, that thought was for seven All right, we're supposed to have some dinosaurs in these cages. Empty now, that's not good. Right, we might have a cold green. Let's keep our eyes peeled. Oh, 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 take cover! Oh, so sorry, everyone. Oh, no. Alright, I'll be honest. This actually happens every day. We cannot keep these dinosaurs in their cages. And on the left, that's the Spinosaurus, one of the largest dinosaurs of the franchise from Jurassic Park 3. Uh, this year actually marks the 30th anniversary of Jurassic Park. Happy birthday, Jurassic Park. Oh no. Ooh, yikes. Yeah, that's all the proof I need. And I think we can safely say there's a man and a shark in the water. Let's keep our hands and feet inside the tram if we don't want to lose them. I saw they had a Dark Horse comic book store, which was an awesome find. There was a life-size Tony Stark Iron Man suit there, which was very exciting for my sister because she's a big fan of Tony Stark. And then I bought a rare, highly detailed Hermione figure for 50% off the price. In fact, it was even more than 50% off.
After that, we drove to the Sugar Free Shack, which is a sugary free bakery in Torrance, California. After that, we drove to Torrance Beach. It was very windy, but fun there at the beach. Thursday, we drove to see the Hollywood sign on Hillside, then drove to Hollywood Walk of Fame to see the stars. After that, we drove by the Chinese Theater. Drove to Little Tokyo, ate lunch there. After that, we drove to Corona Inn in Anaheim, close to Disneyland. After that, we ate dinner at California Pizza Kitchen. Yes. Well, I love it. You're welcome to eat some barbecue. Yeah, you can eat the and Friday, we went to downtown Disney to look at the shops and the logo store. Nice. It's the the music players. Drove to McQuiet, Nevada and stayed at Eureka Hotel. Saturday, swimming in the morning, then we drove back home. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed watching the clips and the commentary. And yeah, leave a like if you did enjoy the video. Subscribe. Until next time. Peace out.